layer of the, the central southern high plains. In any case, it's that dry line that often triggers severe thunderstorms. That'll be the case Monday afternoon, then into Tuesday, showers and thunderstorms develop right along that frontal boundary. Dublin, Georgia had a nice Sunday afternoon. The sun is still with us on Monday and our highs will be well into the 70s across Georgia. Nice looking day in Charleston, yet showers and thunderstorms begin to develop across Nashville, Birmingham, Memphis and Jackson. Some of these storms are likely to go severe, especially near Texarkana, Texas, Arkansas. That particular area is in an enhanced threat. Now there is a slight to marginal threat extending into western central Mississippi and even into southwestern Tennessee. This means thunderstorms can produce all types of severe weather from the damaging winds hail to the isolated tornadoes. As it stands now that the greatest threat is still across Arkansas at the moment. It's all part of a slow moving front. Making headway into the mid to lower Mississippi Valley, an area of low pressure is developing and riding along that boundary, enhancing that severe storm threat, the instability in the atmosphere. What's not helping matters much with that is what we call a dry line that separates the warm, humid air from the warm, dry air of the, the central southern high plains. In any case, it's that dry line that often triggers severe thunderstorms. That'll be the case Monday afternoon, then into Tuesday, showers and thunderstorms develop right along that frontal boundary as it continues to move through the rest of the area. Flash flooding, likely in this particular region, Monday afternoon into Monday evening. Showers and thunderstorms continue for most areas Tuesday.